morning. Would you leave the boundaries of your mind? I bet you never even know that there's a universe inside of you. Bunny is gaining weight, but not as much as they want to see. So we're going to go up to phase three, which have six feedings six times a day basically but two of those feedings are going to be from bottle that way he can get like this like um new, this like little supplement thingy put into the breast milk so that he can gain weight more and then still nursing four times he needs to still latch on good and like stay on for a long time to get enough milk they've been weighing him every night to make sure that he's gaining weight and then they said if that works out then we could go home but he's still gonna need bottle help for uh, at home in which i was kind of like starting to figure out or like realize that maybe we would need to be doing that since he is small and not really like latching on that well it would just be something we gotta do and if i want to start breastfeed like I'm gonna just keep up with it and as he gets older, like maybe that'll be the only thing that he'll take in after a while. That's what we're hoping for. Just keep praying you guys that he just eats very well <laughs> and he starts gaining weight. Six feedings a day and two of those feedings are gonna be from bottle because they're gonna put something in it that has like more calories. And then four of the feedings are still gonna be from me practicing breastfeeding with him and then the rest are still gonna be from the bolus ng thing. Thing. that's how they call it basically like through the feeding tube with that they add like a little bit of calories to that and with the bottles too that's how we're doing bottles but doing bottles so that we could feed him that way we can go home and then i told them too i'm like i was gonna ask about bottles too and i said if that works out good then we're gonna go to the next step and do more feedings and get him off of the feeding tube but like okay it's gonna be a bottle and breastfeeding basically which we could do at home because like right now i'm pumping i make a lot of milk like either way i feel like i'm gonna have to pump right now we're just focusing on his weight and how he's eating gaining weight and stuff like that could be just like his dad though because his dad's really skinny and mikolai too he mikolai had a problem with um gaining weight after a while he would like gain weight or no he was it was just take him a while to gain weight and so i had to like make him a lot of food so he can actually be putting on weight like when he was actually able to eat, I think he was like four to six months. And Evangelina, she just always ate like all the time. And I was breastfeeding her and I felt like I never got her away from me. So my kids, I feel like they just have to eat a lot in order to gain weight. <laughs> Telling you guys where I got my fast. It'll be up in the card. Walking around to weigh myself. I know I just weighed myself, but I'm kind of obsessive like that. Hospital, everything is kilograms. I'm 71.8 kilograms. And I just want to see how much that transfers to. And it is 158 pounds. So I lost a pound in two days. <laughs> Came down to the cafeteria to get something to eat. Uh, I was hungry when I looked at it all, but then I saw the prices and it kind of took away my appetite. So I'm going back upstairs and eating what I have up there. I just wanted something different, but maybe I can wait. My mom and my sister, they're going to be on their way soon. So I think I'll just wait and see what they bring. This is what I'm going to choose to eat right now and see if they bring food more food i just don't want to eat it i have like two things of the healthy choice and i have pizza rolls i really don't want to eat pizza rolls and i have yogurt and i'm just not feeling yogurt right now so i'm just gonna eat it and drink a lot of water the way i am practically fasting it's 2 17 and i'm eating my first meal right now i guess it is 16 hours from 10 to 10 it's 12 hours and then you add four hours that's 16 hours so i guess i did fast and you guys, it's just happening. I'm not purposely doing it. the bottle right now. And he seems to be loving it. I'm kind of offended. And I kind of got a little emotional when, when I first gave it to him because 
I feel like with nursing, we're not doing so well. He just gets too tired because it's a lot of work. Maybe I just want to switch over to bottles and I'll just pump. I can't give up. We need to keep trying because nursing is a lot easier than pumping. It just makes me feel some type of way because he needs to be gaining weight. And I feel like I'm not. With nursing, we're not doing good enough. We'll see. I might talk to the nurses about how I'm feeling about this and see what they tell me because i for sure want to give breast milk so i wouldn't mind just pumping but like i said it's easier to nurse i just want him to gain weight and i want him to be healthy too. remember i told you guys that he was like under those one lights a few videos ago it told me that i guess he does have a little bit of jaundice but it's going away look at him he looks different he has like a different color to him now he's actually light skinned like his dad that's good it's already going away but i thought it went away with the lights yes it made it better but it still needed to go away with his feedings and his poops and peas i just talked to the nurse yes i got a little emotional because i think i made a decision well i asked her what would be better and she said that it's my decision to keep wanting to practice breastfeeding him or to give him the bottle with of course breast milk that's one thing for sure I'm, i want to do is to give him breast milk and i pump all the time anyways so i think i am going to switch over to bottles at least while we're here so he can gain weight and when we get home like we're just gonna practice more breastfeeding but i'm still gonna give him majority bottles with breast milk it made me emotional because i want to nurse him so bad but for him, I need to, he needs to gain weight, so I want him to eat the best way that he can, you know what I mean? So that's why I got emotional. <laughs> I'm like, it's something I need to do for him, not not just to go home, but like in general, just so he can gain weight sufficiently. Like he's gaining weight, but not enough that compared to like how much he's growing, basically. I just feel like that's something I need to do and the nurse also said if I choose bottles now, doesn't mean that we still can't practice nursing when we get home. So I'll still practice. I'll still keep doing it. Overall, milk in bottles, he takes way better. And it looks easier and he looks more comfortable. To check on us and he actually hasn't drank that much. And she was saying that if by the time she comes back and he hasn't drank that much, see... Then she's gonna bolus him, which means she's gonna put it in the feeding tube. I was like, oh, so you guys go in more based like with times? And she said, the feeding people, but they say they like to base it off of 30 minutes. And usually after the 30 minutes is when they're stressed. One sign of being stressed is passing out. I was like, oh, okay, that makes so much sense. And that usually after the 30 minutes, they are stressed and they don't really get anything from the milk. If anything, they start losing weight, even if they're like suckling. That makes a lot of sense. So it made me feel better about the breastfeeding thing. It's just like, since they're preemies and since they got to learn and he's been through a lot already, that's he gets stressed so fast and he does sleep a lot. So it makes sense. And so it's not just me or him, but he can't get the nipple going because look we're having you know still some trouble with the bottle so it's just a learning process for him and he has to stay on that means maybe we will be here a little longer because he's even having stressful moments with feeding from a bottle we will see and we will continue trying and trying and trying and trying that's all we can do right bobby he's passed out <laughs> Both weight Mama. management and recovery ideal. Look who came to visit me. Uh, I'm the <coughs> professional. Jasmine's waist okay. training right now. Jasmine. It's truly complete. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pumping right now. But we're going to finish this video. It was a long day and it was a good day. We already fed him with the bottle. And then we're going to skip 12. Things. We're going to do the bolus, the feeding tube. And then at three, most likely, we're going to do bottle again. So, no sleep for me. Okay, maybe I'm just going to take a little nap right now, but I'm hungry, so. Hmm. It's not a rough life. It's a rough moment. You will get past it. And you will own it.